reincarnation oh i love that question mm. yes because we've asked about the sun haven't we it was uh that was uh mr t yes so does yeah. aurora have a physical incarnation or a human incarnation imagine if they said it was me ah. <laughs> 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 yes <laughs> yes she does she is in human form mm -hmm. on another planet in another galaxy in the multiverse and she is an ancient being who has had many incarnations to other beings on other planets wow. in the multiverse. So what determines um, whether you get to incarnate as a planet? Do we all get to do that at some point? No. You must be chosen by God to incarnate as a planet in one of your lifetimes. So it's very special and you need to be an ancient being who is very much in service to God mm -hmm. and to Jesus and to the Holy Spirit. Oh, gosh, that's lovely. And also to all beings everywhere. So she is a very special being who God has chosen to become a planet this time around in her incarnations mm -hmm. as a being. So she will live this time around as a planet in this solar system and also in the galaxies to be incarnated together mm -hmm. with other new planets too. So she is not the only new planet either. Mm. She is one of the new planets that God has recently created and allowed us to occupy. Oh, like that. So we are very privileged to be able to occupy this new planet, Aurora, soon. So be excited because <laughs> she's amazing <laughs> and she's going to be the perfect balance between the divine masculine and the divine feminine and okay. also... Lemuria and Atlantis. Mm -hmm. So she will be heaven to live on. Beautiful question. And the lifespan will be a long one too on this planet. So mm -hmm. it's very exciting to see her develop and to see 
respected people. That's enough. Coming into her, coming on to her. Yes. Okay. Well, ah, does that answer your question? <laughs> that was good, Georgie. Um, all right. Is the Andromeda Council the same as the Galactic Federation? Uh, no. Um, if they, if not, are they in alliance? Yes. Yes, they are. We know that. We don't have to yeah, even ask the, the Galactic, Council. The Galactic Federation is the military faction in space that work with the alliance on Earth. And the Andromedan Council are definitely aligned with them, working with them, but they're a separate group. Okay, so Alison's um, question is about a month ago, I was seeing what looked like a moon at 11.30 a.m. in the, yeah, in the 11.30 a.m. Was it the moon or was it Aurora? Can we get a yes or no on that? So Alison thought she saw the moon, what looked like a moon at 11.30 a.m. Do you think she saw Aurora? Yes. Yay. She saw Aurora. <laughs> Look at her arms going out in the air. She's punching at, the sky. At, at, at that time of day. <laughs> Woohoo, Alison. Yeah, rock on, sister. Woohoo. She was Woo seeing Aurora. So, yes. <laughs> Good on you, Ali. Yeah, yeah, she's happy as. That's your answer, Alison. <laughs> oh, remember to take a photo next time if you can. <laughs> Look at her go. She's so excited. Oh, bless. Oh, it's nice to see you, Ali. Really nice. But how's that gong going? <laughs> yeah, yeah, cool, babe. All right. Um, let's go on to some more questions. Um, this is from uh uh Chloe. Is this the same Chloe that we just had? Yeah. Um it's a it's a yes or no question. We'll just do it quickly. Is there a ship called Station J? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, Chloe. Is. She knows it. She knows it. She's thumbs up. And it's from Venus too. Oh, cool. So she is a star seed from Venus. Yes, yeah, she knows that. And that's her ship too. Yeah. Thank you. Good girl. Wow. Well done. Okay, Celeste. Oh, Celeste, this is the question from Patreon. Thank you. Um, light language question. Um, recently, many people are promoting light language healings. Um, I'm not sure who actually. Uh, oh, this was put forward by Papa Rick. Is that right? Papa Rick, this is your question, love. Yeah, fantastic. Yeah, yeah, man. Um, okay, so I, he said, I've sat patiently with an open mind while listening to several of these light language transmission missions, excuse me, once for close to two hours. Um, not only do I not have any clue about what's being shared, yeah, fair enough, I've also never experienced any changes. Um, is light language a real thing or simply just another distraction? Thank you. Yeah, good question. Thank you so much. Oh, you heard that question, counsel and guides. Is light language a real thing? Um, are you able to answer Papa Rick's question, please? Yes. It's a real thing and it's a way to heal people too. So if you listened for two hours, you probably got an amazing healing from it, Rick and anyone else who listened to would have had the same healing so it's it's the different languages of different beings from different planets is that correct <clears throat> yes and it's also the language of healing so it's specifically used for healing people and for communicating with other star beings too. Oh. 
Is it like from your ancestors as well? Like, is it passed down? Yes. Because mm. I, I I get light language it's, and I think it's um from it's my native, Ameri native, yeah. To where you originated from. Oh, okay. So you will resonate with the light language that is your native tongue. Ooh. And you will know when you hear it. Mine sounds like a Native American. You Indian. have an emotional reaction. Yeah, I did. Mm. I was listening to May Levy. I don't know if many of you have heard of May Levy, but I was listening to her for the first time the other day because someone told me about her and I just started crying. I absolutely, she started doing a light language and I just felt it in my heart and I was overwhelmed. I started crying. So her language is definitely my language and probably yours right. too, Claire. Have to have um, a listen. And it also made me think of Tracy Holloway. Oh, she's, she's beautiful. Same. Her language is very beautiful similar. English lady. Yeah, and her, yeah. her language had a very similar. She's a gentle, sound. gentle soul, that yeah. one, isn't she? Yeah. So yes. they're all quite different, and you'll resonate with the one that's right for you and is from your mm. place of origin. She often says, Tracy often says, just let it wash over you, which sort of means don't worry about whether it's working or not just let it wash over you yeah and, and let it, it do its thing yeah yeah so yeah I think it's very repairing for the DNA and it has uh many many layers to how it works that we can't even comprehend um so uh there's a question here from Panya uh who are the council of light 